Hello and welcome to State's Mirror News, Karnataka. Today's headlines. The Supreme Court in a unanimous judgment effectively opened the doors for disqualification proceedings against Maharashtra Chief Minister Eknath Shinde for defection from the Shiv Sena and held that the Governor Bhagat Singh Koshiari erred in calling for a trust vote which triggered the fall of the Uddhav Thakre like Mahavikas Aghadi, MVA government in mid-2022. In a blow to the centre, the Supreme Court on Thursday gave the Delhi government power to make laws and will control over brokerage deputed to its departments while declaring that civil service officers are politically neutral professionals who serve the people and not parties. It is no surprise that most students seeking admissions to pre-university colleges UC have been preferring a combination which includes computer science for quite a few years now, this year as the admission season is gaining pace. Bangalore-based Mahiti Hakku Adhyayana Kendra, MHAK, has written to the Chief Secretary of the Karnataka Government alleging closure of the Integrated Finance Management Services, IFMS portal to citizens and release of rupees 1,000 crore to contractors without uploading information on the portal. Sense of jubilation prevailed in schools that are part of the Hindu in School, THIS program as they recorded 100% results in the SLC examination. The results were announced on May 8. There is definitely a need to improve voting percentage and political parties have to introspect why the manifestos and candidates are not able to inspire confidence in voters to come out enthusiastically. They say Bangalore records 55% voter turnout, barring postal votes and home voting. The former Chief Minister and Janta Dal Secular Hashri Kumaraswamy left for Singapore late on Wednesday night for medical test. Chief Minister Basavraj Bomai on Thursday clarified that he had never said the BJP would 150 seats but expects the party to get a clear majority. Stung by the exit polls that have projected in an edge to the opposition Congress, BJP state leaders have maintained that the exit polls will be proved wrong when votes polled in the Karnatic Assembly elections are counted on Saturday. Former Chief Minister Jagadish Shetter, who quit the BJP and contested election on Congress ticket, has alleged that for the fear of losing election in Hubbali Dharbar Central Assembly segment, BJP leaders distributed money ranging from Rs 500 to 1000 in slums of the segment. Keep watching States Mirror News, Karnataka.